Russia is dying, its population steadily shrinking. Shrinking as a result of poor health care, alcoholism, chronic stress, and poverty. Around 30 million Russians are not even connected to sewage systems. Wars continue to add to population decline. The Kremlin often sends young men off to die at war in other countries. Over the past 30 years, Russia has started more than 10 wars. The result? Russians dying young or leaving their homeland. Russia takes up a large land area, but a great part of it is thinly populated. In 20 years, over 20,000 Russian settlements have disappeared from the map. Their inhabitants have either died or left. The Russian birth rate is extremely low, while the mortality rate is one of the 10 highest in the world. Average life expectancy in Russia is very low. The country has one of the highest suicide rates in the world. Another important factor to population decline is Putin's rule. Over the past 10 years, with the regime becoming more and more totalitarian, at least 5 million people have left the country. And these are mostly educated professionals. By starting a war in Ukraine, the Kremlin has made the situation in Russia worse. The brain drain has become extensive, and it's nowhere near stopping. Russia is losing its people, which can soon lead to the collapse of its already stagnant economy. The Kremlin is aware of these facts and uses the war in Ukraine to improve the demographics in Russia. Proof can be found in the multiple illegal deportations of Ukrainians to Russia. Russian forces are illegally taking Ukrainian children away for Russian families to adopt. This is a war crime. These are all signs of decay. Russia is weakening and bringing death to a lot of people as it does.